714 and 43 degrees on your Thursday morning. And on this Thanksgiving Day, a local group working to make the holiday a little brighter for those in need. Our own Cassidy Lance live from Farm Street this morning with all the details on a very special free Thanksgiving dinner. Hey, Cassidy. That's right, Renee. Good morning. We're live here in Union Mission's Grace House. We're actually in the kitchen where in just a couple of hours or just really minutes now, people will be arriving to prepare food for a big community feast that Union Mission will be hosting today for people in need. They're expecting hundreds of people actually to come out and feast on a delicious uh, menu of traditional Thanksgiving uh, food and, the, you know, the turkey, the fixings, everything. And uh, we have two very special guests with us today. First, we have Steve Allison. He is Executive Director of Union Mission. Steve, thank you so much for joining us. We really appreciate it this morning. Thanks again, Cassidy. Happy Thanksgiving. Really appreciate you being out. Thanks for covering what we're going to do today. Well, happy Thanksgiving to you. I know this is such a special event. What makes you guys, you know, why is this so important to come out on Thanksgiving and, and give back to the community? Well, it's important because people who have a need on a day like today um, really need to get that need addressed. Mm -hmm. And so we just want to make sure we provide an opportunity for a healthy meal and mm -hmm. a caring environment, let people know that the holiday still can be a joyous time. Okay. All right. And, and what are you guys expecting? I know uh, you're partnering with Gulfstream for a long-lasting partnership. Um, how many meals are being donated, and, and what are your expectations for the day? Well, through the support of Gulfstream, a great long-term partner, and, and they're also being assisted by Sodexo, mm -hmm. we'll provide meals for 300 individuals today wow. here in our cafeteria at Grace House on Farm Street. Mm -hmm. uh, so there'll be a crowd of folks that'll just be moving through. We're volunteers. 30-plus mm -hmm. will be serving, clearing tables, ushering people through. It'll just be a great festive environment where you can feel uh, a sense of joy uh, on a holiday, even if you may have a point of need otherwise. Right. Uh, this meal will help kind of close that gap. Right, definitely. It's a fantastic thing that you guys are doing. Now, we also have with us Mr. Anthony Kirkland, and he is a resident here at Grace House. We appreciate you joining us, and tell us what it means to you for them to be serving these kind of meals to you on Thanksgiving. Well, um, it means a lot to me because, you know, like I've been in prison, I, and it's my first time at Thanksgiving to have a real meal. Mm -hmm. And uh, Grace House have, have been good to me, you know. When I came from prison, I didn't have anything. Mm -hmm. I got clothing, I got shoes, I got coats, and it just overwhelmed, you know. And I just want to say thank you to the Grace House and, and Ms. Spalding and Ms. Artis and Ms. Gaines and Ms. Moore because those are some good counselors and they did a lot for me. Well, it just shows that Grace House is really doing so much in this community. And, and Mr. Allison, give us the details for how, when it's all starting off today. The meal will be served at noon. Mm -hmm. uh, our volunteers will start arriving about 9.30 or 10. Mm -hmm. uh, our guest folks who will be dining with us will probably start lining up quite a bit before noon. Okay. Uh, but we'll start serving at noon until 300 meals are served. We'll be here through the early afternoon. And uh, if you have a need, mm -hmm. don't have a place to go, we still invite you to come on down. There will be room for you. All right. Well, again, a great thing you guys are doing. You have a long day, but I know it's going to be worthwhile for sure. Mr. Allison, Mr. Kirkland, thank you so much for joining us. And that's it for us right now at Union Mission on Farm Street. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. I'm Cassidy Lance, WJCL News, working for you.